Hello guys, um, in this tutorial, uh, I'm going to show you how to have the collisions with the item box. Yeah, and you're going to be able to walk through on top of it in this tutorial also. But, um, sites, I, uh, I didn't add that in my, in my part over here. If you want to, you can easily... You easily can. I'm going to show you how to do all of that in this tutorial. Okay. Let's get started. So. Uh, oh, brought. Uh, okay. So I'm back. Um, in here. Now all you want to do is select your M jump. Right click on it. And click copy. And then uh, right click on the free space. And you're in here and click paste and jump copy very useful and I'll rename it to sensor top sensor top top okay hey, now we're gonna edit this in a program called GIMP. Now, uh, if you don't want know what GIMP is, GIMP is um, a free um, art tool that you can use to make um, like that you can use to make sprites. Okay, zoom in to uh, to over here, and it looks very good. Yes, then you want to draw a selection. If you don't know how to draw a selection, I'll show you. I so that you'll draw a selection by doing like this. Make sure, make sure um, that you are, now take two pixels off. Like one, two. I, I don't really think I can do this, so let me show you. Make uh make a selection, then uh make it uh, twenty eight by five, and that's basically gonna be the width and height for those. Now, take the move it and put it over here, and that already took two pixels off for us. Nicely done. Now, while you're selecting it, press the this uh, uh create a new layer uh, now over here uh yeah so um then press okay it doesn't matter really all this stuff now this layer thingy then we're gonna choose then it we have a layer thing over here uh, and we're gonna take this bucket tool fill it fill this part in Green, I, I want to use it in green. Then uh, go on to the center top, say delete the layer by pressing on the X button. And then say image, fit canvas to selection. Oh, I totally forgot. We have to uh, put two pixels on again. So, change this to 32. Now, move the selection over here. Now, uh, I just, uh, you remember way back in episode one when I said uh, you can't move selections around? I just got confused between paint and gimp. Yeah, so, uh, yeah. Now, it ha it's like this. Now, press control E to save it. Or you know what? Actually, controls I'll control Z of these things. And I'm gonna say image fit canvas to selection. And, oops. Now uh, I'm gonna grab a, a set canvas to selection again, and then we can export it by pressing Control E on the keyboard. I'm gonna name it Center Top. First of all, I need we, I need to delete the Center Top that looks like Mario. Oops, you can't delete it on GIMP. Okay, just say replace and it will delete.
did it a uh, replay I did it a uh, replace cause there is already one then I'll click export I will discard the changes because it's already saved as you can see now we have a little sense as you can see over here and now uh, I'll open oh, uh, I uh, I assume how it was a completed one okay now uh, we want to upload a sprite at the center top and click open to confirm now uh, as you can see now we have it in here now we want it to first be able to follow mario drag with me a one flat click it and grab a forever loop then grab a go to walk go to zero zero uh, uh, and then you grab a backdrop of stage block this one duplicate it and put it in here and actually grab a plus operator and put it in here and then replace it and then add it in here and say 20 and here we're gonna change this to Mario change this to Y position and do the same for here but leave it as X position now it moves along with Mario sorry I want to make it quick sorry I wanted to make it quick but it's okay uh, uh, now as you can see uh, now the ground now uh, as you can see but there are no collisions yet so let's make collisions so add with me a new when for click walk um you can do it next or under i want to do under so uh grab a forever loop grab a if then grab a or statement and that's where we're going to be broadcasting collisions if uh, or if touching item one or item two this is the name of my item boxes you can name it item box one item box two or whatever uh then we want to broadcast top collision broadcast message top collision oh uh i was typing really fast top collision Yeah, there you go. And now I'll react to it. Go into the Mario sprite and grab a when I receive top collision block. Grab a set velocity block. And instead of sending it to a level, I, I uh, duplicate it from up here and was all. I'll change it to negative two. I'll grab a change velocity by gravity. It's always in here. Oh, yeah, I just like duplicating stuff. Oh. And I needed to change Y by velocity block. So drag them both into this uh, change, change velocity or gravity and uh, change Y by velocity. And now there's collisions. You'll see. But a weird green thing on top of Mario, and it's not supposed to be there in the game. Stop the game. Go on. Go on to your sensor top. Grab a green flag event, green flag click event, forever, uh, set, the uh, ghost effect, the uh, ghost effect, yeah, ghost effect to, uh, 10, um, are actually 100, cause now, there's nothing on top of Mario's head, uh, now, uh, Now, as you can see, like this. Now, uh, is, is this giving you an idea? You can add a cover. Like here, you can write Super Mario Bros. 3 and put it. I uh, don't really want to do that. I think it's already in a good speed. So, I just deleted the background because it wasn't really good to be all white. I made it transparent so that you can see. And by the way, you can import backdrops. I don't have a problem. Uh, anyways, that's it for this tutorial. For more tutorials, uh, look at my channel, and you'll see you'll see plenty of tutorials. Okay, see you later. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Bye.
By the way, guys, I forgot my promise where I told you uh, uh, I'm going to show you how to make him go up. So uh, don't close the video yet. Um, now, in here, where you got the long ore thing for the grounds, you uh, want to grab another two, uh, another three ores. Or actually, only two. Then uh, drag the this in here. Then I'll drag the whole thing inside here. Then, then oh, by the way, uh, press Control Z if something bad happened to your game, like you uh, uh, accidentally deleted blocks. Um, that's okay. Just press Control Z. Then I'll grab another touching. I'll say touching item one or item two. Item two. He's still gonna stick to it if you like do like this. Now if you do like this, and you're gonna see that he he falls. That's a bug, and you can also go into him and like that. You can like see only an item box, and you can't see Mario. And then you jump, so he pops out. That's kind of funny, and I don't think Mario can reach them, so I'm gonna change the over, over here to minus 40, and this one also minus 40. Okay, now uh, we can get the item box and jump on top of it. The next tutorial, we're gonna be adding uh, in a mushroom to go out to go out of the block, and that's it. Okay, see you later everybody. Bye. See you in the next tutorial.